Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. You are back with Mystery Meerkat, and today we are playing something a little different. Uh, it's a game that I've actually had for quite some time, and I've been waiting for it to get to a point where I would be happy playing it for you guys, and I think that's about now. Uh, they've just added uh, extraterrestrial stuff, as you can see down here, um, into the game, uh, which means that they're getting close to the space race uh, part of the game, um, which I believe is their, their end goal uh, for, for the game, you know, from the actual full game as it were should i say um and then there's obviously going to be dlc i would i would presume after that point but uh, i thought i'd jump back in at this point um so yeah hopefully you guys are going to enjoy this i know that uh, you kind of like to watch me sometimes play some strategic kind of games so let's get into this and see what the game's like nowadays wake up wake up creator this is the beginning of your story. It starts with nothing. Nothing but an infinite void. However, you, with a single touch, can awaken the light. And so the universe wow. sprang into being. Worlds filled with endless potential were scattered into the beyond. They formed into many different shapes and sizes. And while most were doomed to drift among the cosmos barren and alone, others flourished. These few planets soon became home to the greatest phenomenon of all. Life. However, life is a peculiar thing. It comes and goes as swiftly as a bit of space debris burning up in an atmosphere. A creator's purpose was always that of an observer, to simply admire the fleeting beauty of life's beginnings and ends. Yet this balance could never last. The issue with allowing a species to evolve independently is that they always fail to do so. For life to have a better chance of succeeding, it needs a helping hand. Ah, here we are. Welcome to Mother Planet. This is a rare sight. For it came to be that there was day and night. Warmth and cold. And water to flow through the planet's veins. The soil was rich with minerals, which gave rise to a thick blanket of green. The perfect ecosystem was formed. It is no wonder, then, why life has chosen to inhabit it. A new species has been born, and they need guidance. This is your purpose now. Their very existence rests in your hands. Well, guys, for an intro, that's pretty epic, I would say. Um, okay, let's zoom in here. See what we have. So we can move the planet around. We can zoom out, look down at the planet and move it. Uh, so now we've got to choose a place to put our epicenter, which I presume is like the middle of our civilization. Now, ideally... I want it to be near some trees, near some rocks that we can harvest. And later on, is there any mines and stuff around here? Not what they are. Okay, um. What's this thing down here? Is that like a crashed asteroid? Strange. 
Alright, so... I'm not actually quite sure where I want to put this, guys, to be quite frankly honest. I, I kind of need it to be in the middle of, you know, everything. Oh, here, here might not be a bad idea. Like, just right here. Got some trees to this side. I mean, a bit of a distance to water. Maybe if I put it, like, here. Yeah, that... Probably a good idea. Alright. Let's see. Uh, put that right there. Yes. Take a look at your new subjects. They're oh, look called them. nuggets. Largely because of their body's apparent inability to keep itself in one piece. Hadahi and Elu, the architects of their species. They are the founders of everything that Nuggets will ever know or achieve. This is quite a beautiful planet. Try not to ruin it, will you? They're creating a stone hut themselves. Devil's Lettuce. Deadly seed. We don't really want them to eat the deadly seeds now, do we? So we can speed up time as well. Um, so let's just do that while these guys build whatever they're building. Well, that's as fast as they go, apparently, so <laughs> we might be waiting a while for this. We'll have to see. We might do it eventually. You never know. Message has a peculiar smell. Did there you write it? One of the stone huts done. No current laws in place. Oh, the summer sun is excellent for slow roasting a few nuggets. As well as keep your civilization running. Okay, so these are my little dudes here. We have a tough time doing all the work with just the two of us. Is there any way we can expand our civilization and maybe bring in a few extra helping hands? I sincerely hope there's an easy way of going about this. Not that it doesn't fall months of discomfort and weird cravings followed by hours of excruciating pain. We've got to use the creator power. We can't. It says coming soon, right? So we can't use that right now. Let them figure this crude process out for themselves. I'm sorry. I can't, I've got to ignore you because, you know, I'm sorry. You'll be fine. You'll find some people or create some people soon. I'm sure. Research panel. Primitive tools. We already got this. Yeah. Dug well. Water wheel. Oh, we need the water pump. We need fire and we need the well. Let's see how this goes. And we need water storage. What else do we want? Fishing. Yeah, I'll do that. Yeah, there we go. Escape out of that, there we go. So this this is basically the startings of the civilization, guys. It's it's probably gonna take a while to actually start doing things. Uh, wrath, influence, protection and creation. Creation. We can rejuvenate people already. Cooper on. Nuggets are all unique to one another. Although there are some things that are shared between nuggets, these include the need for certain essentials like food and water, a stable roof over their heads, 
and an occasional nap. They want to learn, build, discover, and create. It would all be quite inspirational if they also didn't happen to be the species that initially thought their shadows were trying to eat them. I don't know how I'm supposed to do this with them. Okay, so we can build stuff, so let's go on here, let's see what we can do. Production. Your civilization grows stronger Nothing. with every item you research, creator. Water pump. We need water, which is over here. Let's pop that down right there. So, I actually can't remember how to rotate things in this game, to be fair. <laughs> Which is not good. Uh, there we go. Right. There we go. Okay. So we put a well. Well, well, well. Right, right there. So effectively we're going to start building around here. There's a few things around here that we can get to. And then as we build out we can sort of build out into this area. And there's some more water here and here for fishing. Which is good. Um, and that's going to be the next thing that I think I'm going to be starting to look into. Is like fishing and things. Like things to do with food. Have a look at the research. What we've got. Want the toolkit, want that, want that as well. So we just want this to keep keep ticking over the research, really. Uh, amount of nuggets that believe in you, none. <laughs> I mean, we're going at the fastest speed that we possibly can. Okay, guys, so it looks like... Our nuggets are getting nicely acquainted. Look at that. A little baby nugget. Aren't they adorable when they're young? Don't so get too attached, though. They're still mortal after all. Plus, they soon be old enough to have an opinion and make questionable life decisions. Let's see how much you like them then. All right, yeah. So we've got uh, two... Two little kitties running around now. Um, we're still waiting for them to finish the little bit over here. Uh, but they finished the well. Well, well, well. That's well, the water pit, whatever you want to call it. Uh, they finished that. Uh, we're just waiting for them to finish the water pump now. And then I'm not sure what we're going to do next. We've got some reservoirs, which are really useful in winter. Um, I'm thinking I'm just going to put those in the same area as as this guy. To be quite frankly honest, because they're right next to this water, water. Pump system is rather advanced for such a young civilization. I mean, sure, it's built out of rocks, wood, and a bit of string, but impressive nonetheless. Oh, there we go. That's that done. We've got a little reservoir getting built over here. We need to get the reservoir done before winter. That's my main priority at the moment. Because we need that for winter. Fishing's being researched. Um, we've also completed the water storage. Uh, that's why we can build the reservoir. Uh, we can do a dug well. We're waiting for fishing, the toolkit, uh, primitive cooking, this casing, and shamanism currently. Uh, so we're just waiting for those to be researched. Uh, we've obviously got these little guys which should grow up into adults at some point. Um, not entirely sure. Oh, here we go. So this this is where it will uh, turn into a, a young adult, I suppose. I'm not 100% sure. We'll see. Oh, we'll see so we've researched fishing, which means that we should have it's a fishing pier now. 
I'm going to pop down. I'm presuming that's going to have fish in it, right? I mean, I can't see any fish in there. Now I'm gonna I'm gonna take my chances. I'm gonna put it on here. We kind of need more people to build this stuff for it's us. It's getting a bit chilly in here. Winter is coming, creator. Oh my! I do hope you've taught Nuggets how to swim. Uh, I haven't taught Nuggets how to swim, but they're just gonna have to deal with it, right? Because, yeah. <laughs> I'm afraid that that's what's happening. Um, we need some more huts, legendary buildings, cosmetics, epicenter, archive. Oh, we could get one of those, I guess. Probably we can't build any huts. Maybe they just build the huts themselves. Name the newborn. Nuggets. Dear creator, we finally managed to settle on some decent baby names. I'm sure they aren't as wonderful Is as the ones you would have really selected. What you want to spend your time doing? Yeah. I bet at least our problem is solved. Come and visit as soon as you're able. We really hope to hear from you next time. Okay, alright. Building in bad condition. Open hot interior. Oh, what? I don't know you could do that, that's cool. Uh, how do we rename the nuggets then? Like, I don't understand. Well, maybe I'm just supposed to go on them to edit their names. Where are they? Where are you, little nuggets? Stick. I don't think Stick's a very good name for it, for a nugget. I'm going to call him Barry. Yep, that's what I'm going to call him. I'm going to call him Barry. So they call them Stick and Stone. This one's a girl, so I'm gonna call uh I don't know. Do we call her Liz? Liz, there you go. Barry and Liz. There we are. I'll do me. Alright, we've got a reservoir which is filling up nicely. Uh we've got a fishing pier which is being built. I don't know what else we can build right now. I don't think there's much else that we can build. We've got primitive cooking coming after the toolkit. So we can build an engineer's hut. And an engineer's hut. I know you're always busy, but do you ever take a moment to watch the seasons change? Toolkits. There we go. So now we can build an engineer's hut. And this guy will repair all of the buildings in his radius right, as far as I understand so I don't want him to be like covering pretty much everything I'm probably like that because we're gonna fill this area in anyway at some point so with water sources freezing over your nuggets will have to use water from reservoirs you have been building reservoirs right Yep, certainly have been building reservoirs. We don't need to know about the water pump. I was just about to compliment you on your fantastic new ice sculptures. But then I realized those were just frozen nuggets. Thanks. You look a little confused. Don't worry, I expected as much. I know you have questions. You're not very but nice to me, Mr. everything in time. On your own. Without bothering me. Well, I thought I changed the names. I did change the names. Let's do story, uh, storage areas, then ancient burial. Because then they'll, they'll want us to build a graveyard for the people who die. Really, if we could speed the game up more, but... I don't know. Barry and Liz just formed a... F Your brother and sister, that's weird. That is extremely strange. 
At least the cooking's finished. Creator, I'm beginning to feel that nuggets have the wrong address. Do they really think you can solve these problems? Yeah, of course. If you don't start keeping your buildings in better condition, I'll be forced to pass out eviction notices. Pop it there. That's another stone heart. I don't know where they're going with that. I mean, it's quite small. Uh, quite close to the other one. But, you know, whatever floats your boat. Oops. I'm going to do the grass weaving. The grass, grass weaving is probably going to be a bit more important to me at the moment. As we build this little village up. So yeah, I, mean, I hope you guys like this. Um, hopefully when, when winter clears we can get some fish out of this pool, pond, whatever you want to call it. Um, but yeah, I hope that you guys like this. Like, like I say, it is alpha. Uh, I think I've already mentioned that. Um, there are bugs still in the game. It's... Um, it's been out for quite some time, uh, you know and at the moment. Work far more Ooh, let's have a look. Assign nuggets to them? We can assign somebody. Let's assign. What's he good with? He's good with eating. Liz would probably be I good. I heard that one asking around about work benefits. They're going to be quite disappointed. There we go. We just need them to build it now. Everything's working a lot faster. Help Barry finish his hut. This one is just being lazy. I don't know. You're being lazy. I'm not ignore that. That's right. You're not some fairy they can call on whenever they want. Let them do their own busy work. <laughs> I can't say I'm a fan of nugget delicacies, but it should keep everyone relatively alive and happy. Oh, I do needs seem to, be in to there. brew some interesting beverages, though. <laughs> Apologies. Right. What do we want next? Calendar, I would say. Is there anything else that we can build? Got well, we've got an eatery, we've got engineers. We need an archive. Which I would like to put opposite here if I can. So there we go. I'm gonna prioritize that hut first. So that gets done really fast. Right, the archive is fully operational, so let's put somebody in there. It'd be either he or Elu. Um. Is this what counts as research nowadays? Someone just scooped up some mud and decided to paint the first thing that came into their head. Actually, it isn't the worst idea. Okay, so the archive works as a save game point now, which is weird. Uh, I'm just gonna save out the mystery maker. You're not planning on leaving us like this. Uh, no, I'm not. I'm not leaving yet. Don't you worry. Um, right, we've got something else to build. Oh, we can build a hospital now. Oh, the hospital's big. Um, maybe we should pop the hospital like there. Seems like a good area to put it into me. Yeah, so I'm just waiting for them to go fishing now, but they don't seem to be wanting to do it. Anyway, right. What have we done so far? So we've got the... Are people going to die from like starvation and stuff? They're still affected by the cold or what? 
Oh, come on. See, I've kind of forgotten, like, do we need a hunter's hut to be able to start doing things? Like, we could put a fishing place over here, too, actually. Things are beginning to look green and happy again. Oh, here we Let's go. Let's take a moment to appreciate it before you do something Yeah, they're going wrong. out now. Going out to get water now, we're good. Thinking that, yeah, I'm still thinking maybe that another fishing place down here wouldn't be too bad. That's a big open body of water. We've got storage areas that we can build now. Warehouse. Will that fit in there? No. I'm gonna put it behind here though. Yeah, I'll do. Just thinking of the pass, guys, because this pass coming down here and going around here. And along here, so if I build it here, there'll be another path that goes up, hopefully, that way. Yeah, because this one comes around like that. We'll be able to get some other stuff in here. I'm, I'm hope I'm going to leave this like little area here for them to build their huts in, around the well. Um, just because it seems sensible to do that. And it looks like the yew tree's got food in it now as well. Maybe not. Oh no, I think one of the nuggets has died. Barry's died due to hunger. We've got food now. Oh man. That always happens. Where did Barry die? Oh, everyone's dying due to hunger. I have a feeling that I've not really started this guy this game off very well, guys. I should have focused on the food first. I'm down to three nuggets. That's not that's not good. Oh dear. Okay, so what I've learned so far, guys, is that this game is really difficult to play. That's what I've learned. <laughs> that was a cemetery that we can build now. Yeah, wonderful. Thanks. Thanks ever so much for watching this particular episode of The Universe Sim with Mystery Meerkat, guys. Um, if you have indeed enjoyed watching, please do leave a like. Any comments that you've got, leave them in the comments section down below. Let me know whether you want me to continue this uh, game going on. There's one more episode to come, uh, which will probably be released next week for you. So I hope you enjoy that one as well. And lastly, if this is the first time that you've visited the channel, please, please, please subscribe. It helps me out a great deal. Uh, just let me know I'm making great content for you and uh, that's all I'm uh, all I'm really up for doing so anyway guys peace out